is Nurifan and Risa Irfani. My group members and I will present about the marketing strategy used by Rami Group in their marketing. The Rami brand is no stranger to being mentioned on the lips of Malaysian and has been known for its product, the Burger Patty. Ramli for Persasi Senior Merhat, better known as Perusahaan Burger Ramli Mokni Senior Merhat, is a local Bumi Putra company and it was founded by Dato Dr. Haji Ramli Mokni and his wife Datin Haja Shalasia Abdul Manap in 1984. The couple has built a platform in producing halal, clean and quality burger patty products. The company is located in SME National Park, Mukim Batu, Kuala Lumpur and currently has 10 subsidiary companies operating within the group. Do you know the land area of the whole Romney factory? The land area of the Romney factory is 14 acres. It is so big! At the beginning of his business, Romney only had his main product which was burger meat. But now, Romney has produced a variety of frozen products that are ready to be cooked and in many categories from burger, cocktail, frankfurter, nuggets, and many more. Currently, they have 45 products in total. The Romney group has supplied patties to street vendors throughout the state in Malaysia. Next, my other group members will explain to you the marketing strategy used by the Romney Group in marketing their products. Thank you, Narisa. Hi, I'm Dani Arisha and here's my metric number. Let's go to the next slide. This slide is regarding marketing mix. There are four types of marketing mix which are price, promotion, product and also place. So I'm going to explain about product. Ramli Burger has patties as their main product and customers will buy the famous burger which come in two flavors, beef and chicken. However, these products are halal, clean and quality. Ramli brand goods are well known in the Malaysian market. This product should be stored frozen at a temperature of 18 degrees Celsius. Other than that, it will be easier and very convenient for us to prepare our meal or dinner for our family or even for ourselves. Ramli company not only produce burgers and frozen food, but the company is also famous for its streets, stalls that have been selling burgers in every state in Malaysia. It is not difficult to cook Ramli's burger meat, just a simple ingredients that need to prepare which are Maggi, seasoning, sauce, Malaysian spices, chili sauce, margarine and an egg. Therefore, Ramli Burger also conduct R&D research and development to ensure and make sure its products are fresh, delicious and quality. It is really important for this company to achieve satisfaction in the long term. Besides, most important things that customers need to know is that the company has established a microbiology laboratory to control the product's quality. This is to make sure the products are fresh, taste, uh, quality and safe to eat. Thus, this product has a very well-known brand and a good product creation concept. Thank you, that's all for me. Let's go to the next slide. Hi and Assalamualaikum. My name is Noor Elena Shahira, Bitti Razafizi, and my ID number is 6221512-1694. And I will be presenting about the price of marketing strategies. According to Rick Sutter's uh, 2020, pricing strategy is defined as a method companies use to price their products or services. And price is the monetary value assigned to a product or service, and it is the result of a complex set of uh, calculations, research, and corporations, as well as the ability to take risks. Uh, almost all businesses, large or small, base uh, the price of their goods and services on productions, uh, labor, and advertising costs then add a percentage to cover profits <coughs> margin. It is the amount of money that Ramli's uh, customers must pay in order to purchase the burger in this case. Cost best pricing will be used as the pricing strategy. O according to Guerrero and Amara 2020 to set the price, cost based pricing use information from the product cost and at the preferred margin. 
because the cost of production is quite high. Burger are expected to be more expensive. However, the price will be kept to market it affordable to the main target market which is student with low income. For example, where Ramli Food uh, Processing Sedang Bohat sell the Ramli Chicken Burger in 420g, 360g and 300g size, the company can profit RM2.35, RM2.10 and RM1.90 respectively. Ramli Beef Burger in size of 430g, 600g and 300g costs RM2.70, RM2.30 and RM2.95 respectively. For each pack, when selling the Ramli Beef Burger, the company can earn RM2.35, RM2.30 and RM1.35 for 420, 330 and 300g respectively. Tesco chicken and beef burger retail for six ringgit per forty hundred twenty pack on the market. Rabbit chicken burger is slightly less expensive than Tesco chicken burger. A pack of Ramli chicken burger for four hundred twenty gram costs five ringgit eighty five cent, while Tesco chicken burger costs six ringgit. That's all from me for the pricing strategy. Thank you. Thank you to Eliana. My name is Nur Afina Nadir Abitrahmar. We we'll continue with one of the four P's in the marketing mix that is promotion. What is promotion? Promotion is a communication method used to inform, introduce, and convince consumers about a company's manufacturer or sold product. When a company wants to market a product, it will utilize a promotion such as advertising, sale promotion, and public relations. Advertising is the one of the market that the Romney Group use. Advertising is marketers' payment for one-way mass communication about a product or organization. This advertising is applicable to inform consumer about a newly released product, recommend a new product, clarify misperception, promote the company's image, and other purpose. Magazines, newspapers, and television were used for advertising by the Romley Group. Due to the rapid development of the technology in the current period, businesses often use electronic and social networks to guarantee that their products are widely recognized. This company has also used media for promotion, including Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and others. Sale promotion is another method for luring customers to purchase a product. Sale promotion is a tactic for encouraging consumers to purchase goods from commercial organizations. This strategy allows customers to sample their goods, increasing brands, identification, and sales. Ramli used a sale campaign organized by its subsidiary, Ramli Halamat, which operates nine stores in Peninsula Malaysia. In addition, they also provide membership programs so that customer can get a low and affordable price. If they participate in the program, they can get a discount offer when they purchase a product. It will increase Romley products desire and gain place in customers' hearts. Public relations are the marketing function that analyze public views, identify organization areas that the public may be interested in, and implement a program or activity to get public acceptability. Before launching a product, Romley first assesses its public relation to determine the customer's behaviors. After evolution, Romley product will determine whether or not the public is interested in them. For example, they will offer their product in frequently visited shopping centers and sell their products in retail outlets to ensure that they are accessible and available to all customers. Besides, it creates its stalls, which provide customers with complementary product samples and organized programs in front of shopping centers to develop its company to attract customers. This advertising plan will help improve the position of Romley, a company that has become a well-known brand in recent years. That's all for me. Thank you. Formerly known as a perusahaan, 
program or is here my in the meantime uh, the company owned is a processing plan located at Nana Green Gasia PKS Mutian Batu Kolumbo which is uh, also offer uh, career opportunities in management, production, marketing and uh, product distribution uh, and then uh, Ramli company also opens up many other job to op uh, opportunities to help people who don't have a job uh, to work for especially recent graduates. Uh, furthermore, uh, today uh, the Ramli has uh, 10 subsidiary companies with a strategic group of companies. Uh, the first is uh, Ramli Food Industry Senior Bahad and then uh, Ramli Food Processing Senior Bahad, uh, Ramli Food Marketing Senior Bahad, Ramli Food Services Senior Bahad, uh, Ramli Halal Logistics Senior Bahad, Ramli Halal Mat Senior Bahad, Ramli Mokni Holding Senior Bahad, Ramli Halal Cross Senior Bahad, Ramli Faulty Integrator Senior Bahad, uh, Ramli Management Senior Bahad, Ramli Azen Corporate Senior Bahad, and then the location operating within this group. Um, meanwhile, uh, Ramli uh, is a frozen food uh, industry company with uh, Ramli brands product based on halal, green and uh, quality which is established uh, in 1984. The company has grown rapidly from a factory operating in Baden to Raja and now in the Taman Pindasrian ITS Mukim Batu, Kuala Lumpur after growing more rapidly and to meet grow demand, a major factory has state of the art and high performance machine equipment with worked uh, with uh, 1 million and started its operation in Selangor, Halal Hub, Pulau Indah in mid 2019. Thank you. Now uh, I pass to the next presenter for recommendation. Hi, my name is Nur and I'm Shahram. You are PC. My ID number is 6221521694. Now I'll be presenting about recommendations for Ramli Burger. For the first recommendations, Ramli needs to open more stores in different parts of Malaysia or around the world. Furthermore, Ramli should broad, broaden its market because the product is not available to all Ramli clients. Customer in Kelantan, for example, are unable to purchase Ramli products since there are no Ramli halal mat or kiosks in Kelantan. Especially after being evaluated by a number of well-known YouTube food critics such as Shadow SSMR, Ramli Cheesecake sales have increased as a result of its social media expose, exposures. Second, Ramli should be more forceful in marketing communications. Marketing communication is a strategy used by a firm or a business person to communicate promotional message about their products and services. Furthermore, marketing communications uh, on experts create Preparation sort of persuasive communication and convey it to the intended audience. Third, to completely achieve their potential, uh, they need to use other aspects of marketing strategy with better knowledge. For example, in order to better understand customer behavior, they may look into the four psychological process of motivation, motivation, perception, learning and memory. This will allow them to dive further into what the customer want. Aside from their deadline, businesses may build a good brand motto that will give customer more faith in their good. Uh, as a result, Rami Group will be a leader in fast food marketing and all nations. Consumer will be completely aware of the company's missions. That's all from me. Uh, thank you. We have come near to the end. To be concluded, each company must have its own strengths and weaknesses to organize the right strategies to face the challenges in a particular industry. Romney Group is a company in Malaysia that is experienced in organizing business strategies and using effective marketing techniques in the fast food industry. The fast food industry in Malaysia is very wide including great brands from abroad, but 
Brownlee Group still maintains the momentum to remain in the fast food industry. The products produced by Romney are quality products and even Romney has obtained halal certificate recognition which should not be adopted by Muslim consumers. The prices offered to consumers are also affordable with other brands making Romney the top choice of most Malaysians. To acquire Romney burgers is also so easy because in most of the stalls throughout the housing in the urban area especially there will definitely be someone selling Romney burgers. That's all from our group. Thank you.